2005, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yo guys, Josh here, and this is part 6 to my fact video. Still again, another 10 facts for how to cod zombies. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, so let's start off with the, um, uh, number 1, which is the, uh, uh, believe it or not, uh, there were actually pack camels for cut weapons and black ops. Now, obviously, you know, all these weapons, I literally scoured the internet for about 3-4 hours, and I could only find these 6, uh, uh, photos of pack camos of cut weapons for black ops i couldn't find it for like world at war black ops two three four or five i haven't couldn't find any of that but yeah this is a very simple one just cut weapons had actually fully formed camo all right number uh, two all right so number two is actually a really fun one so you know you're you're playing let's just say you've never played black ops 3 before so this to you seeing this icon at the top of the max ammo icon you're like oh that's that's normal uh, that's that's a, just a very normal one and i took the yeah, i took like hd photos there so yeah so yeah you're like oh that's normal but what you don't know is black ops 3 shadows of evil originally had this icon which can only be seen in last gen now that was the actual icon for Black Ops 3, the newer gen, but was removed for unknown reasons, and there is what it looks like. It's pretty cool. So now we move on to uh, number three. And number three is, uh, number three is an interesting one. This is, uh, so first I'm going to show you the prices of the gobble gums. Obviously it's, it's, uh, zero, but if you're playing last gen, it's 500 points as seen there. So basically, as you see on the bottom, fire sale doesn't just reduce the price of the box. It also reduces the price of the gobble gum machine. Now, yes, I am showing, uh, last gen also for just these three uses. And then I won't show last gen because I just want to show that other than in the first use the the gobble gum prices are exactly the same Ex yeah they're same except for like the first use and stuff like that all right so obviously the first use is, is going to be zero you know all these prices will vary because from round one to nine the prices are different every 10 rounds the prices change other than the first use because the first use for newer gen is zero last gen is 500 so basically yeah you know, I always wondered this because I would use the I would use gobble gums. I'm like, why does it say 2020? I'm like, why is it such odd uh, prices? That is because fire sale affects the price. So now, all right, yeah, number four. Let's get on to number four. This right here is something I've been wanting to talk about for a year. So do you all remember? Oh, and P.S. I'm playing my playing with myself right here because my friend had to go and I had to film. I had to film what I had to film. So yeah, I had to kind of solo this. So. So, you know, we all know that when in Black Ops 2, Ma Alcatraz or Mob the Dead, the golden spork steps or the kills can only be done with one person due to the fact that only one person can get the blunder guy, as I demonstrate here. So yeah, I didn't, I'm playing in this, yeah, in this account I named Joe Mama, you, you don't get to actually see it, which I should have turned my remote so you could see the name because it would have been funny. So yeah, the the original Mob the you grab the spoon after your friend does all the steps you come over here you stir it yeah da, 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 da. and i'm not gonna i'm not gonna really edit these clips just to prove that there's no like bs or anything so i'm like yada 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 the the blood stirs the laugh happen and then basically now you get the this is so easy because i remember my friend would like lag out and then soon as he would spawn in i'd cover him hell's retriever spoon put it spork and then boom there you go you get the golden spork this was a fail i was like <laughs> i don't know what happened here oh man my gut uh so yeah now now we move on to possibly what could be Oh, and ladies and gentlemen, you don't even need to get the silver spoon to get the spork in uh, in in Blood of the Dead. So yeah, a little FYI, ladies and gentlemen. I, like I said, I've been wanting to talk about this for a year. This is going to be uncut just to prove. For an entire year, every zombie YouTuber got it wrong by stating this fact. 
every person has to get all the kills or every person has to get the kills in the tub to get the golden spork when that is not true at all. How do I know that? Well, I thought to myself, let's try some things. I remember first two weeks of the game coming out, I'm like, uh, I didn't do the kills and I got the golden spork. And then my friend's like, maybe that's just a bug or something. A year later, I can still do this. So, uh, yeah. So in case you're in case you're wondering what's going on, my friend did Darian did all the steps for the spork, which is knock down the crates by hitting the thing, ground a spoon, spoon in the tub. He has the acid got out, so he got all the kills in the tub. Now, just so yeah, I could prove it, you could see it, it's so amazing. You don't even need to get the silver spoon. I didn't get the silver spoon to prove that. How would I have got the kills if I didn't grab the spoon is the thing and the answer is I don't you don't need to get the kills Only one person needs to get the kills just like the original even though in the original you one person can get blunder got in this Everyone can and just like that ladies and gentlemen. I have the golden spork and I did nothing Darian did everything I did absolutely nothing so uh, yeah, it that's been bugging me forever. That that is, you can try it yourself because it works. Oh, and if you're wondering, can I grab the silver spoon? Uh, and no, after you get the golden spark, it won't let you grab the silver spoon. And the subtitles are on because of what's coming up next. So yeah, all right. So now we move on to number uh, five, and number five is the uh, believe it or not. Uh, only in Blood of the Dead you can get a zombie blood. If you type in 872, I think you have to unlock pack first, I'm not sure, but if you hit 872 in this code, you can actually get a zombie blood in Black Ops 4, and I didn't know this. Well, you know, I knew this because this is a step for the Easter egg, so like when we did the Easter egg, I'm like, oh, this I didn't know. I didn't know your character model actually changes, and with blue eyes. My friend Darian's like, we were both kind of freaking out. I'm like, uh, I'm like, why is my character have blue eyes? It's so weird. It's like Rick Toffin is, uh... Well, if I was Rick Toffin and I got zombie blood, I would have been like, oh, uh, Stoolinger and stuff like that. Kind of what's to come. But yeah, that was pretty cool that you, my character model changes. Like in Black Ops 3, the, the, the zombie character. That's pretty cool. Alright, so now we move on to uh, number six. And number six is da 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 da. You can actually revive someone with the spirit blast of the uh, spectral shield. I didn't know this until I tried it one day. Someone was down. I'm like, hey, watch this. I'm going to hit him with the shield blast. And it actually revived him. I'm like, what? So yeah, just shield blast, boom, revived. I forgot that, you know, there's so many different kind of hidden ways to revive people. It's just, it's pretty cool all right so now we move on to um number seven uh if i'm correct this is the oh yes so ladies and gentlemen uh i'm gonna show clips in here and you can see so the original color for these was red on the left and yellow on the right but in the final as you can see here yeah yellow on the right it, it's it's uh it's interesting, and you'll notice too, the colors were swapped. Red was on the left, now it's on the right, and then blue is on the left and stuff like that. So, uh, this can actually only be seen in the first trailer for the Resurrection, uh, resurre no, I think for the, uh, the, yeah, yeah, Resurrection thing, so yeah. Alright, so, number eight. We are going to move on to, so, uh, yeah, so we all know Dervunda Fizz, Teddy Bear Pierce. All right, so while I'm talking about this, I did want to quickly point out one thing that I couldn't point out too much on the previous fact with the Zap Gun thing. So just to specify, the only way to see the Zap Gun yellow is in the very first trailer because for some reason the second trailer actually shows the real colors, which is uh, red and blue, I think is what I said. Uh, yes. It is, no, no, it was blue and red. Yeah, yeah, that was right. So yeah, you only can see blue and red in the first trailer, which surprisingly, I couldn't find the first trailer uh, for Resurrection in on the Call of Duty YouTube page or the Treyarch YouTube page. I had to find like IGN or PlayStation something to view that trailer. So that was kind of weird. But anyways, basically what I'm showing here, I, I added a little bit more so I could like talk and stuff like that, like from, uh, from uh from the uh yeah so yeah 
All right, so I'm just quickly trying to remember here if I said everything that I wanted to say. Yep, pretty much we're all caught up. We're good to go. So yeah, uh, this uh, this I only figured out because I play last gen for the video sometimes. So yeah, we all know Black Ops 2. When you get use a go when you use Vunafiz enough times, it's a teddy bear bottle. Black Ops 3 teddy bear bottle, but. For some weird reason, I don't know what developer thought it would be funny to do this, but uh, for some weird reason, the developer decided to do something kind of funny, and I really was surprised the first time, and it was this. They decided to throw the actual teddy bear in their wound. I don't, this was funny. I'm like, what? That was so weird. I'm like, what? It's so weird. Why did they do that? All right, so now we're going to go on to number nine. All right, so number nine is a very simple one. So we all know when you play Call of the Dead, VR11 changes zombies into the uh, into the real life guys. The CIA models turns them human, but for some weird reason. Well, no, not for some weird reason. You know, the mechanics for them work the same as a zombie when they're in the barrier, as can seen here. I always thought for years that this attack that they do did damage. Like it says in the text, this either does no damage or super little because I don't have Jug, as you can see. I have PhD, and they are giving me the beatdown. And I'm not just saying a little beatdown. They are giving me the beatdown. Like, look at how many times I'm getting hit. You would think I would have died by now, but I got hit a lot of times. So, yeah. All right, so uh, before the next thing starts, I'm gonna I'm gonna end it now because number uh, fact number uh, ten here. I just gotta let you guys hear it for yourself. So thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen. Samuel, Samuel Stolinger. What? Oh no, not again! Calm yourself, Samuel. We're all friends here, are we not? Uh. Not really. Me and Russman are buddies, but, uh, I hate that girl with a passion. We have no time for such petty rivalries, my friend. I fear that Maxis may manipulate your companions into following his orders. He can be a very convincing liar. I should know that. For now, you must focus on only gaining control of the tower above ground. It is more important than you can possibly imagine. So... No pressure, then? The components necessary to build an energy conduit to power the tower can all be sourced from this location. When you find them, you must ensure that they are not used to help Maxis. You have to do what I say, Shadow. It really is very important. You need to get the others to do what you tell them. That's what working together is! Do it! Explain it to them. I don't care if they are talking over you. Just tell them what they have to do! Just keep sticking your goofy heads out! Ah! Perfect! What guillotine! Find it, bring the parts to this location. Together we will thwart Maxis. Why don't you listen? <laughs> Did I do something wrong? <laughs> I'm so annoyed, I don't even want to speak to you. Don't worry, we don't actually need to cut off his head. I was talking metaphorically. Although decapitations can follow in type of hit. have all remained safe for so long, my little popsicles. Perhaps you could be of use. Hm. Nein, I much prefer you all this way. I suppose now we know where he went. 12,042 bottles of beer on the wall. 12,042 bottles of beer. You take one down, you pass it around. 12,041 bottles of beer on the wall. Samuel? Who ah! in the butt? Is that you? 
This is an element 115 based delusion. You are in cryostasis back in the lab. How could you? The lighthouse. It must have triggered a chain reaction in the ether. <laughs> I do not have time for this, nor the strength. Stop the bird! Stop the bird! Stop! Ah, the book is gone! Why can nothing ever be simple? Yeah, that's a shame. He doesn't trust you guys. And what exactly would you know about it, Samuel? Hmm? Jeez, touchy, touchy. Ever since you guys switched on the lighthouse, I've been hearing all kinds of freaky, geeky chatter in this place. Haven't been able to make out much, but that little bird, he chirps pretty loud. Brilliant, Samuel. I was unaware you were fluent in seagull. Uh, what are you guys doing here still? Video's over. It's done. Can't you tell because of uh, all the picture frames right there? Oh, they're showing that stuff. Alright. Uh, these machines, are they licensed by the city? We ain't getting out of this unless we look out for each other.